Nowadays, we are very much health conscious. We do physical exercises, diet, and regularly visit doctors to know about our latest health condition. The amount of time and money we spend behind our physical health, we don't spend same amount of time behind our spiritual life. To be spiritually nourished, we don't take much initiative. But to be sound healthy and wealthy, we take a lot of initiatives and troubles. To be sound spiritually healthy, we need to give more importance of our spiritual values. In today's Gospel, we have heard that Jesus is a divine healer. He touches a leper and heals him. By healing him, Jesus reveals divine love and mercy. We all know that at the time of Jesus, leprosy is considered a terrible disease like COVID-19. An attacked person is isolated from people and society because it is a contagious. Imagine how it could be difficult for a person to be isolated from loved ones and to live alone in a lonely place. Jesus feels such people's agony and he heals them. From the Gospel, we know that a leper is a symbolic. It has a deeper meaning which is a deep isolation or rejection from loved ones in the family or in the society. We reject people through our words and deeds. We stop talking, sharing, and visiting people. It may happen within parents, siblings, and friends. Dear friends, like a leper, do we recognize ourselves that we have leprosy of anger, hatred, and jealousy, and request Jesus to heal us? Dear friends, from the light of the gospel, let us humble ourselves and implore Jesus to heal us from the leprosy of anger, hatred, and jealousy. May God bless us. Yeah.